2018 Land Rover Discovery Sport Review. The good points of Land Rover Discovery Sport. Premium appeal. Design. In Cartec. 7 seats. The bad points of Land Rover Discovery Sport. Occasional rear most seats. Not perfect for running costs. This could be the Alni Land Rover Discovery Sport also it combines reduced interior, having a huge dollop of practicality plus a go anywhere method of travel. The new 4x4 is actually the inch-level model into discovery ownership the Freelander has ceased production and is particularly smaller versus the Alni Discovery because of go on sale later in 2016. Its design will probably be familiar to the people who have in mind the Range Rover Revec. A small 4x4 that is a real sales success for Land Rover. It's a significant departure through the more practicality focused Freelander and exhibits a bit more dynamic appearance and feel. It will offer an alternative substitute for customers considering an Audi Q5 or BMW X3. Premium interior for 7. Land Rover has stated the Discovery Sport incorporates a more compact footprint than most traditional 5 seat 4x4s but buses is an extra two of seats for occasional passengers as standard. The fit and complete is really premium too, while using front dashboard featuring an 8-inch touchscreen in the center and plush quality materials used during the entire cabin. Engines old and new. It will likely be initially launched while using diesel engine currently utilized in the Freelander, that will deliver a claimed average of 46 miles per gallon. This will likely be offered which has a 6-speed manual gearbox or perhaps a 9-speed automatic, in addition to 4-wheel drive. Later on in 2015 there will probably be a new considerably more fuel-efficient version referred to as the ED4 that emits just 119 gkm of CO2, nearly 61 miles per gallon typically, and features tow-wheel drive. This also is likely to feature because intralevel level model charging just under £30,000. Rumour is the fact that 2016 will see cover all new, more fuel-efficient engines fitted inside Discovery Sport. On-road agility and off-road ability. It's a natty phrase that Land Rover believes underlines the very fact the Discovery Sport will probably be as capable off-road and surprisingly of a vehicle carrying the green logo, while providing a fantastic drive on tarmac. It uses Land Rover's terrain response system as standard rendering it easy for a person to select the appropriate setup many different conditions and attire including snow, mud and sand. There's another suite of electronic systems to assist off-road including hill descent control, traction control and stability control. Tested in very tricky off-road conditions the Discovery Sport inspires driver confidence and proves extremely capable. New Driver Aids the new Discovery Sport also comes with the phalanx of driver aids including automatic emergency braking which assists avoid a major accident in low speed traffic and enables mitigate a collision at faster. Other driver aids introduced to the Discovery Sport include traffic sign recognition, parking assist helps steers the auto into a parking space, lane departure warning and front and back parking sensors. Land Rover Discovery Sport performance wasn't simple to assess during its first test completed on snow-strewn Icelandic roads. However, the 187 bhp 2.2-litre diesel engine, as found in the Range Rover Evoque, aligned while using 9-speed automatic felt strong and smooth of these conditions. This engine's key characteristic could it be as packed having a hefty dose of pulling power 420 newton meters of torque that begins from low down the rev range. This makes it much easier to drive smoothly and it is well suited for the silky 9-speed automatic that slips so effortlessly involving the gears that it must be hard to tell when the auto has changed gears. It makes for a fantastic motorway cruiser likewise as very easy to drive out and about. The SD4 can also be available having a revised 6-speed manual gearbox which marginally adds to the claimed average fuel consumption from 44.8 miles per gallon to 46.3, and reduces CO2 emissions down from 166 gkm to 162. That places the sport in road tax band G in spite of the gearbox chosen.
it is enough shove to permit the discovery sport to tow nearly 2200 kilograms brake towing weight which increases to 2500 kilograms when the auto is fitted with all the torque pack for those seeking to reduce running costs Land Rover is promising a tow-wheel drive version 2 WD with manual gearbox dubbed the Ed 4 that literally brings emissions as a result of 119 GKM of CO2. Look out for the exam of it soon. The Land Rover Discovery Sport works also off-road since it does on-road on account of a lighter body as opposed to outgoing Freelander along with a raft of driver aids. On-road handling. Land Rover has created much with the comparative lightness with the new Discovery Sport and exactly how it includes a positive effect on agility while traveling. This was tricky to gauge on winter hit Icelandic roads nonetheless it rides well plus it's tough to see why the sport won't prove a great deal more responsive to leader inputs and feel more composed as compared to its older sibling, the Freelander. The Discovery Sport also incorporates some useful driver aids including electric power assisted steering that's speed variable at low speeds a compact input gets big change of direction. At higher speeds a compact input gets small change of direction, dynamic stability control, traction control and engine drag torque control to avoid the wheels locking in case you come off the throttle quickly. All these systems are built to assist the driver in retaining full control from the vehicle even just in tricky driving conditions. Off-road handling. The Land Rover Discovery Sport Dirtability is every bit as strong and is also fitted together with the same terrain response system as situated on the Range Rover Evoque. The driver simply selects the under tire conditions from general road, grass gravel snow, mud and ruts, and sand. The drivetrain then adjusts to deliver the best utilization of power to give the maximum traction and safety. The Discovery Sport also features hill descent control, Gradient release control and roll stability control which all help be sure the sport doesn't escape shape. On a snow and ice packed off-road course the sport proved so capable it felt like driving over a normal road or so it was only hitting deep snow you realized the work the automobile was doing. Throw in the wading depth of 600 mm plus more if hand decent clearance at both sides of your vehicle and also the sport is likely to live as much as the off-road capabilities the Land Rover brand is renowned for. The driver is greeted by the well-balanced blend of premium materials and robust-looking controls. The V will probably be familiar for the owners in the bigger Discovery and much more stylish Range Rover Evoque plus it feels well screwed together. The tire feels solid and is sold with extra functions to master cruise control, audio and telephone functions, using the two conventional speedo and rev dials spilt by an electric screen. Controls for climate control, heated seats, wind demisters and fan speed dominate the upright central console, while above is a brand new 8-inch touchscreen technology that responds to finger swipes and pinch moves to get into various functions such since the sat-nav, speakers and car performance modes. Smartphones both Android and Apple will also be connected via USB gain access to Land Rovers and control apps. This means your vehicle's touchscreen display becomes an extension in the smartphone for particular apps including vehicle, internet radio and door-to-door sat-nav apps, along with accessing the phone's calendar, contacts and music library. Otherwise cell phones and MP3 players may also be connected via Bluetooth. All Discovery Sports come using a pop-up drive selector that twists to choose park, reverse, drive and sport modes. Behind that is really a cubby area with an armrest that lifts approximately reveal another deep storage hole. You will not be disappointed with Land Rover Discovery Sport comfort levels. Front passengers secure an abundance of leg, shoulder and headroom, and according to the trim level chosen come with lots of adjustment. The second row of seats slide backward and forward to increase or decrease legroom and as a result of a 6040 spilt the seats might be set at different distances to fit one or two particularly longer legged passengers. The third row of seats are for occasional use for adults and teenagers, and acceptable for longer distances for smaller children, though with all the rear seats on e-websites for as little boot space left.
This could be a mid-sized SUV however it comes using a lot of kit as standard and several very useful safety technology too. Land Rover Discovery Sports Equipment. There are four trim levels to pick from, say, say tech, HSC and HSE Luxury. A new range topping trim was added for 2016, HSE Dynamic Luxury. Say trim standard kit. The intra-level trim features 5 plus 2 seating including a 6040 spilt second row that tilts and slides to leg room, plus 2 fold flat rear most seats. It also features partial ear that upholstery, a 10 speaker audio system, 8 inch touchscreen mounted inside central dash. Front seats secure heating and 6 way manual adjustment. Navigating the multimedia system. The property screen controls the audio, climate, phone and sat-nav functions, while a finger swipe away is 4x4 and off-road status, eco-performance and ambient lighting control. Heated windscreen, cruise control, DAB radio, Bluetooth audio connection and 18-inch alloys complete the kit lineup. Say Tech Standard Kit. This version adds an Stuttgart based SatNuff system with touch features and functions 3D city models and views of upcoming junctions, traffic jam announcements, lane guidance icons and motorway junction traffic sign displays. Customers may also update the automobile's maps, plus use voice commands to go in a destination. Satec also features auto lights and windscreen wipers, front parking sensors. Power tailgate and front fog lamps. HSC standard kit. This derivative secures an upgraded sound system featuring 11 speakers, an amplifier and subwoofer for claimed superior sound. Buyers also gain full leather seats with 8-way electric adjustment, panoramic sunroof, xenon headlights with LED running lights, keyless entry, reversing camera and larger 19-inch alloys. HSC luxury standard kit. It builds around the HSE by building 10-way memory electric adjustment, back to front seats, in addition to the second row seats by a heating other does the tire. There is usually a parallel and perpendicular parking assist system which enables steer your vehicle into parking bays or parallel spaces, in addition to the customer can adjust the inner mood lighting. Buyers is only able to secure the HSE luxury trim while using 9-speed automatic gearbox. HSE Dynamic Luxury. New range topping trim for 2016. On top of HSE Luxury version it comes while using black pack as standard, such as black design touches for example roof color, side vents, door cladding and side moldings, plus gloss black 20 inch alloy wheels. Inside the auto are further design enhancements including contrasting colored inserts and stitching. Land Rover Discovery Sport Accessories. Fears a substantial range of accessories including a black pack that has gloss black grille, black contrasting roof, black door mirror caps and black exterior trim plus 20 inch alloys. There's an entertainment pack such as two 8 inch screens constructed into the back from the two front headrests, a set of cordless headphones, USB port and dedicated handheld control for rear passengers to decide on their own film. TV, music or video game system. The pack also adds a Meridian speakers with 17 speakers. Buyers may also select a full panoramic sunroof with dark tint and electrically powered blind, stainless sports pedals, aluminium T-watch plates, roof rails and also a range of towing accessories. Also on offer are headrest mounted iPad holders with quick release fixings and also a center armrest cooler and warmer box. The high amounts of Land Rover Discovery Sport Safety are already confirmed which is a 5 star Euro cap award, the greatest star rating possible through the independent crash experts. Full array of airbags. It comes well equipped with the driver and front passenger securing front, head and thorax airbags, as the driver can also be protected by way of an e airbag and rear passengers can depend upon curtain airbags. All seatbelts have pretensioners plus seatbelt reminders as standard. The front passenger rear bag is usually deactivated, which can be useful when fitting a child carry cot around the seat. The rear two outer seats consist of isofix for any simple, secure strategy to fit a compatible child seat. 
auto city braking and pedestrian protection. In relation to its proactive safety the sport can be well equipped as standard coming with ABS, electronic stability control, traction control, roll stability, emergency brake lights and lane departure warning all fitted as standard. Land Rover in addition has fitted autonomous emergency braking as standard, a process that is created to automatically brake the automobile if it detects a frontal collision is inevitable. As slower speeds usual for city driving it aims to prevent a collision as a whole and at higher speeds as much as 50 miles per hour to relieve the severity with the impact. Pedestrians also gain from improved safety as fitted as standard is often a bonnet airbag which deploys from the event of the automobile striking a pedestrian to offer greater cushioning on impact. One on the key strengths from a SUV, Land Rover Discovery Sports practicality is specially impressive. The second row of seats slide and tilt for additional passenger comfort, as well as the center armrest folds in to create a load through hatch. Occasional adult passengers or young children might be accommodated within the third row seats as fold flat easily. Boot space is really a very impressive 829 liters, though that grows to 981 liters with all the second row seats slid fully forward. There are four 12V power points and nearly six USB charging points may be specified to help keep tablet and touch screen phone known as happy. Passengers at the start secure cup holders and also a cubby hole within sliding cover while the back and front door bins offer safekeeping of nearly 14 litres each. 